What is a marine protected area? An MPA or a marine protected area is an area designated by the state that has certain restrictions that will protect different marine animals within it. The Talawa Dini Nation is a coastal tribe. All of their subsistence will primarily come from the ocean. They have been stewards of the, the sea and the ocean and everything in it since time immemorial and they have an inherent right to protect what's there and they have since the beginning of time. With the fish camps, you know, we would traditionally dry them on uh, beds of sand and that would be our winter food storage. And it was a key component, I believe, for our people because it was um, a major food source and then it was also a trading commodity. You know, I'd like to see my children, my grandchildren, my great-grandchildren still be able to come to the same beach that I came down here as a young child. Uh, traditional knowledge is passed down from generation to generation. Um, there was knowledge that was passed down so that you knew how to show respect for the resources and the environment and to ensure that um, that species will return. There are a couple different types of uh, marine protected areas that are part of the new network. Um, those are state marine reserves, and that's the most protected. Anything that's there, you, you leave it as it is. And then the other major category is state marine conservation area. There's a pretty wide range and they vary by area. You just need to look and, and look what the local regulations are for those. The marine protected areas are a way to um, monitor the, the science of the area and to really look at how the ecosystem is changing over time. Marine protected areas can serve as natural laboratories to allow scientists to monitor them and determine whether um, changes we may see in the ocean are the result of maybe related to local fishing pressure or maybe related to larger changes in the ocean like climate change or ocean acidification. We're hoping to see eventually more fish, a, a greater diversity of species, and larger fish. And you know, many people have been making their living off the, the ocean, um, the fish, for so many years, and people can't do that anymore. So I think it's really important that we can look at how do we protect them, how do we conserve, how do we manage so that people can indeed make a living again. A marine protected area is like a state or national park. There are areas dedicated to conserve and restore uh, marine life, habitats, and cultural resources. So marine protected areas are important to me because they show me things I can't see otherwise and they also protect it for the future so that then later generations can see it. I just love coming down to the beach and hanging out at the beach and surfing. It just means a lot to have all this. Some of the dangers that are facing our ocean and coastlines are climate change and ocean acidification, um, development along the coast, pollution. It's slowly getting polluted, but we can stop that. There's a lot of things that we can do to help protect our ocean and marine protected areas are just one of those tools in a toolbox to help us solve those problems. <laughs>